you like the idea of looking at shiny, expensive cars while helping sick kids and entertaining your own at the same time, you'll want to gather for a good cause this weekend. <laughs> Putting the fun in fundraising. Love that line. The Queen Alexandra Foundation will be hosting a family-friendly motor car gathering at their headquarters on Arbutus Road in Saanich. It takes place this Sunday from 10 till 2. A feature of the event starts with the Pedal Cars and Safety Village, where your little tyke will get their first lesson of the rules of the road. These mini models that offer to help us in the segment clearly need a few lessons with all the collision-causing giggle fits. And while we're on the topic of cute, there'll also be face painting, a playground and bouncy castle, all complementing the main event, a giant car show. Driving force behind the motor car gathering for several years now. This is local legend and classic car restoration guru Rudy Konacek. He'll be bringing several spirited automobiles from his collection, and you'll be blown away by some of the makes and models he's got stashed in his secret vault. Great race history 1964 Ferrari 250 GTO Series 2 V12. Absolutely a phenomenal weapons grade workhorse. But Ferrari race cars rich in history aside, his favourite car of cars, the one he fell in love with at 10 years of age, the Mercedes 300 SL. Well, the 300 SL to me is sort of the iconic sports car. You know, it's true, it's raw, it's, it's a piece of art, you know, it was penned, not computerized or generated, you know, it was, uh, it's a sculpture, it's, it's kinetic art. Today, with a crew of restoration specialists, he puts the life back into cars for clients worldwide. His work is so well-renowned, people ship vehicles to him in containers. And even though his main focus is his global business, he still makes a little time to help at home. I, I so strongly believe in the, the Queen Alexandra Foundation for Children. It's really the only sort of thing that I get involved with here on the island. This year, the Queen Alexandra Foundation will help about 1,000 Vancouver Island families, providing treatment and support to help them overcome real-life challenges. Just over a year ago, when Langford couple Rob and Laurie Doucette had their twins seven weeks premature, it was the Queen Alexandra Foundation that came to the rescue. Our oldest is Brooklyn, and she is one minute older than our boy, and his name is Jackson. He's now a happy and healthy 15 months old, but when Jackson was first born, he needed urgent medical attention. And because of that, the, uh, we were introduced to the Queen Alexandra Foundation, and through the foundation, the Bare Essentials Fund, they were able to support us uh, financially a little bit and uh, uh, get us over the hump that we needed until uh, uh, he was able to get up and running on his own. Uh, having living here in Victoria, we don't have any family members here in Victoria. All of our family members are on the other coast. Uh, so we're very much uh, living here, the four of us. Uh, to have a resource such as the Queen Alexander Foundation is just a tremendous asset to our family. And we're very grateful for that. The foundation's goal is that this event will raise $25,000. Now, the motor car gathering has definitely grown since it first started over a decade ago. 200 cars are expected with room for more. A $20 entry fee for each shiny show car will help. But if your car is nothing special, your family still is. You can show me my seat. And your admission is by donation. Reporting from Gordon Head in Saanich, I'm James Green.